Hello everyone, welcome to Pabli. In this video, we are going to understand how to get notified on email for new Facebook leads. So let's say that you are promoting your business using Facebook leads and here every time a new lead is generated, then you want to notify your team about this new lead received through an email. At the moment this form is filled by the user and is submitted by the user, then automatically a mail will be received by the team with the details about this new lead. To do this, we are going to integrate Facebook lead ads with Gmail with the help of Pabli Connect and here our trigger will be Facebook lead ads and our action application will be Gmail. Now to understand how we can integrate and automate this entire process, let's start. Now this here is the dashboard of Pabli Connect software and you can reach here by clicking on the link which is given in the video description. So if you are the new user, you will have to sign up. It is not going to take more than two minutes and also at the time of account creation, you will get 100 free tasks. And if you are an existing user, simply sign in. And once you do that and you have reached the dashboard, now on the right hand side, there's a tab create workflow, click on this. And this dialog box has appeared and here you will have to name your workflow. Now you can give any random name. I'm going to name it as per my objective. Now here my objective is to get notified on email for new Facebook leads, which means that every time I receive a new lead, then automatically my team should be notified on email. So I'm going to click on create. And as we do that here, we have reached another window, which has got two extremely important events. One here is trigger, another one is action. Now triggers and actions are basically those two principles or concepts on which this entire automation works. Trigger here this when this happens, action says do this. Basically action here is the automated response of your trigger application. Now let's understand this with the help of an example. So every time you swipe your card and the payment is made, then you get a response on WhatsApp or SMS about the amount debited. Now this is automation. So in such a case, your trigger will be the payment gateway and your action will be the applications through which you can send these messages. Now let's come to our use case. So here our trigger will be Facebook lead ads. And what would be our action application? We want to send an email. So our action application here will be Gmail. Now you can use any other platform to send mails as well. Okay, let's come to our trigger. Here is the trigger event. Now what is a trigger event? So this is the event that is going to make this workflow run. And here it will be new lead instant. Now on the right hand side, you can see that this trigger will instantly capture new incoming data and the workflow execution will start in real time, which means that this trigger is not polling based. And as soon as you receive a new lead, then automatically this workflow is going to trigger. Now I'm going to click on connect and here Pabli Connect wants to connect with Facebook lead ads account. So I already have logged into my Facebook account. Here I'm going to select add new connection since I'm setting up this connection for the first time. I'm going to connect with Facebook lead ads and here you can see that the connection is all set. So once this is done, now here we have to fill in this information page and the lead generation form. To understand this, let me take you to my Facebook account. Now on the left hand side, we have pages. Let's click on this. So you can see these are the pages that I already have created. Now let's say that I want to work on this particular page. So I am promoting my business to Facebook lead ads. The business is Ayush Herbal Store. So here I'm going to select Ayush Herbal Store. I'm going to take you down. This here is Ayush Herbal Store. And since there is only one lead generation form associated with it, so you can see it has already been captured by the system. Now once this is done, we are going to click on save and send test request. And as we do that, here it is waiting for webhook response, which basically means that now we are supposed to do a test submission so that the data can be recorded here in the webhook response. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take you to Metaphor Developers page. Here within tools, we have Lead Ads RTU Debug Tool. So I'm going to click on this. Now here you can see that this here is the tool which is going to help us in checking our API integration. So here you can create a test lead to confirm that your integration is set up to receive data correctly. So I'm going to receive a test lead now. First of all, I have to select the page and the page was Ayush Herbal Store. And you can see that the form has been captured. I'm going to click on preview form. This is the form and now I'm going to fill this up. Let's say the full name here is Tummy new one two three then the phone number here is then we have the email address which is dummy new one two three at 
fabletutes.com and now I'm going to click on next and submit. As we do that here we can see that the form has been submitted taking you back to Pabli Connect. Let's see if we have received the response here. And yes, here we have received the response. So we have received the complete name, phone number, email address, then the created date and time. And then we have received the form ID. Now, once I have received this information, I'm going to send a notification through email to my team. So here action event will be sent email. Let's click on connect. And here again, Pabli Connect wants to connect with the Gmail account now. Let's select add new connection, connect with Gmail. Now here it is asking me to choose an account with which my spreadsheet is linked. So I have done that and here Pabli Connect wants to access my Google account. This is absolutely secure. I'm going to go and click on allow. And as I do that here, you can see that the authorization has been successful, which means that Pabli Connect and Gmail are now connected. Now, as I take you down here, we have to fill in this information. First of all, the recipient's email address. So here I'm going to write Ayush Herbal Store at Pablitudes.com. Now this information that I have written here is written manually. Why? Because this information is not going to change. The email address of my team is going to remain static. So I have written this manually. Next is sender's name. So I'm going to write Ayush Herbal Store. Then we have the email subject. Here I'm going to write new lead received. Okay. Now I'm going to go down email content type is plain now email content. So here I have the written team. We have received a new lead details are name, email address and contact number. Now we have to fill in this information. So here I'm going to map the information how. So as I click on this, you can see the previous step and this here is the full name. Now this method with which I've added the information here is known as mapping. And this is important so that every time the workflow runs, it can take the new data into consideration. Because if I had written the same information manually, so even when I had received some new lead with new information, it wouldn't have taken that. Instead, it would have taken the same name, email address and contact number. So to avoid that and to get new response every time, we map the information. Now I'm going to map the email address. Here it is. And now I'm going to map the contact number. So once this is done, if you wish to attach a file, so here you have to specify the file's name and here you have to paste the URL. Now remember that the URL has to be in public mode and also the size, maximum size is 25 MB. Now I'm going to click on save and send test request. And as I do that, here we have received the response according to which now my team must have received the email with the lead details. Let's go and check the same. So here you can see, yes, we have received the mail team. We have received a new lead and these are the details. So this basically means that our integration is a success. Now let's check the same in real time. For this, I'm going to take you back to Metaphor Developers page. Here, first of all, I'm going to cancel this, delete the previous lead. And once done, do not forget to refresh the page. Once you have done that here, we are going to look for the page. And then I'm going to click on preview form. Now let's fill in the data. So let's see the full name. Here is demo user. Then we have the phone number. And here the email address is demo at fabletudes.com. Now I'm going to click on next and submit. And as soon as this lead has been submitted, I should receive a mail. Let's go and check the same. So I'm going to take you to inbox and here I'm going to quickly refresh this page. And yes, we have received another mail. So this means that our integration is a success taking you back to Pabli Connect. Let's quickly understand what we have done. So here our trigger was Facebook lead ads where the event was new lead instant and our action application was Gmail where the event was to send email. I hope this is absolutely clear to you. If in case you have any doubt, you can refer to the workflow which is given in the video description. You can also clone the same and start to process immediately. Apart from this, if you have any specific integration to work on, you can always write to us. Not only this, but you can integrate multiple applications using Pabli Connect software. To ask any of your query, you have to write at forum.pabli.com. You can also visit our website, which is www.pabli.com connect. To get all the details about the latest updates, the integrations and applications, you can visit our Facebook group. 
If in case you have found this video helpful, then do not forget to share this with your friends and colleagues so that they can also get into automation and make their life easy. I'm going to see you very soon with different integrations and automations. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Take care of yourself.